But then there's this asshole. <laughs> Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back at Blue Hundred and welcome back to the Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3 commentary. Now we are in the final battle for Earth, part 97. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is plant, plant the tree of might. The Christmas tree of might. Oh, happy dad. <laughs> Well, in any case, I, I gotta admit, Team Four Star made that a tradition for me to watch the Christmas Tree of Might every Christmas, you and, your son join me. and solely for Christmas. Kakarot, I have come here to ruin your Christmas. Christmas is over about two months ago, Melon Farmer. It is. Oh shoot, I came here for no reason. Uh, Happy Kwanzaa. That's not even today. Any case, uh, now we get the fight against Turles, who survived the explosion because bullshit. <laughs> uh, but I, I don't know if this movie's in canon. I don't think it is. But any case, Turles is basically a Saiyan who looks like Goku, but has none of his techniques, obviously. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I, if you were like me and you grew up with the Kids dub. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just that uh, I found Turles the Kaioken attack. All of a sudden, you see random key blasts coming from the left. <laughs> okay, but um. In any case, if you if you were like me and grew up with the uh f the CW, um Dragon Ball Dragon Ball Z, um you would know that uh in the, like right in the middle of the Frieza saga. Suddenly, the Tree of Might. What? <laughs> it's not even relevant then, but, you know, I guess it's non-canon, so they can show it whenever, but still. Any case, uh, Turles, not that hard, but then again, I am still kind of rusty at this game, so Turles is indeed kicking some tail. And I have no idea who voices Turles. If it's Sean Schimmel, I'm going to piss my pants because that is like the best voice besides Goku he's done ever. It's like that one time I pissed my pants when I found out what hot dogs were really were. <laughs> no, I, I to this day I still don't know what hot dogs are made out of, and I hope to God I keep it that way. You know what? Christmas is actually over. Why the hell am I fighting Turles? I hate merrymaking, joy, and fa la 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 la. Extreme close up. And then you see Goku get his face smashed with the camera like, no! <laughs> Sorry, Goku! Krillin! I have no idea what to take that line. It's warm. You know, it, it, this is a very awkward line that, in my opinion, that Sean Schimmel had to perform. I mean, it's, you know, it's like a surprising line, but at the same time, it's very awkward to listen to. It's like, it's warm? I, I don't know. I don't know how spirit bomb energy naturally feels, but... Uh, that line just comes off as awkward, in my opinion. If you heard that toilet flush, ignore it. <laughs> Any case, yeah, my strategy, if you're playing Go... Well, actually, if you're like... Most of these special saga fights take place with Goku early. Because, you know, they're the movie fights, so... Go figure. Um... Oh, <laughs> stop! One millisecond short... <laughs> In any case, uh, I recommend that you use the Kaioken attack. And yeah, Turles doesn't have any beam attacks, he just has barrage attacks, really. And the kill zone grenade, which in my opinion is very lame because you step to the left or right and you avoid it. Uh, hang on a minute. Okay, I thought my ceiling was gonna collapse on me for a minute.
This is St. Patty's Day, melon farmer. <laughs> you know, the, the uh, St. Patrick's tree of might. Uh, it, it must be made. Need the exact same concept as the Christmas tree of might, but the final ending line being, It's St. Patty's Day, melon farmer. And that was the not so final battle for the Earth. Because we in Dragon Ball Z there was like sixty thousand worlds gonna end scenarios, but we win. Just saying. I'm just a saying. Ha 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 waka waka. In any case, Super Saiyan Goku. I am champion Christmas! The hell are you talking about? It's March! Might as well make that joke now because it won't come up in this boss fight, I can tell you that much. Do, do, stupid loading screen. <laughs> okay, there we go. Hey, don't talk down to my brother. <laughs> honestly, uh, I, I can honestly see Slug being Super Kamiguru's brother. I mean, at the beginning of this movie, it was old as. Old as my grandpa. And he's dead. <laughs> I'm sorry, grandpa. I really shouldn't speak ill of the dead. Grandpa, if you can hear me, I'm sorry. No, but seriously, he's dead. I didn't even get to know him. And I'm already talking ill of him. Actually, not really all right. I, all I know is that he's dead. In any case, uh, fight against Slug, because I really need to deviate now. Um, Slug is kind of awkward, in my opinion. It's not like, um, like his fighting style, in my opinion, is the most awkwardest in the game. Yeah, and that includes Kid Chi Chi, but, um, actually, that includes Aureli, now that I think about it. But, yeah, it's just... It doesn't flow right, in my opinion. Ah, oh, I feel like a strapping young lad playing his favorite game. Oh, really? What's it called? Competitive Pitch Toss! <laughs> ah! Okay, Darkness Eyes. Uh, you can avoid that by descending. If you ascend, it's gonna take you a darn eternity. But, um... Yeah, ascending in this game is not like ascending in Raging Blast, where you can just hold... Actually, it is, but it's definitely different. But you're not able to hold, like, L2 and L1 and then just, like, <laughs> ascend to the heavens above. No, because there's actually a limit. But yeah, now you're going to see the constant trope of these movie battles. People, lend me your energy to beat this guy. Okay, he's dead. Dang! Oh, I say, this act of violence is not good. Movie bubbles, I swear to God, in a trunk off a cliff. In any case, uh. How do I transition out of that one? Oh, there's this finger beam where I swear to God he's giving me the one finger to salute. Okay, not really, but still, it, it looked... Yeah, I mean... Yusuke Urameshi put it best. It depends on which finger I'm firing it, and then holds up the middle finger. <laughs> if, you, if you don't know Yusuke Urameshi, uh, Yu Yu Hakusho. Either that, or you can look up his wiki page. The Yu Yu Hakusho wiki. The Yu Yu wiki. The Haku wiki. Hakusho wiki. There we go. The Hakusho wiki. In any case, now we get all into the weirdo concept of Super Namekians. I don't know. If that's the case, then how come Nail wasn't a Super Namekian? I mean, it would make sense. Uh, actually, going into Dragon Ball, actually, Piccolo was technically a uh, Super Namekian because he grew gargantuan! If you didn't watch Dragon Ball, I don't blame you. It's a much slower pace than Z. 
mainly because it doesn't have any many fights. It just focuses on story. <gasps> That's right, something Akira Toriyama made that focuses on the friggin' story rather than the awesome fight scenes. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> but yeah, um, honestly, I do like Dragon Ball a lot better than Dragon Ball Z. I am champion Christmas. What the hell are you talking about? It's March. Don't lie to me. It's snowing outside. Yeah, because we had like 75 snowstorms in the past years. Ah, uh, oh, uh, oh, damn. But no, really, it's snowing uh, in in the northeastern part of America. I, it's been snowing for weeks. Enough. Ugh. I think you can kind of tell when this was recorded. But, uh, yeah. By the way, as I said before, big characters, hits, they hit harder. They're just much slower. So, yeah. In any case, the max power strategy I stated before works a hell of a lot fine. <laughs> it works finer than we did before. It's a hell of a lot fine. <laughs> but, yeah, it, it's, you know... It's a strategy that most people use when they're playing this game. Honestly, if you don't use a max power strategy, you're pretty much screwed at the butthole. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, not really many jokes I can make out of this. Unless Slug grabs me and then I can make this squeaky joke. But no, he's just gonna continuously do that dark ice beam, which worked so wonderfully in the past ten minutes. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I was just waiting for Slug to actually grab me <laughs> when I said that. But no, I just said, fuck it, Kamehameha. <laughs> yeah! Hey, go on. You wanna do that thing you were doing at the waterfall? Remember that thing that pissed me off? Hey, go on. Go on, go on. Don't you fucking ignore me? <laughs> uh, that's the best part of that movie. But uh, till next time, guys. I am Back at Blue One Hundred signing out. Please subscribe, like, and comment. Hope you have a nice day. And uh, till next time.